you're out there, you know who you are. And I'm going to talk about right now in the next few videos, um, what signs there are that you've come across a fake influencer. Why do I care? Because it makes everyone's life super hard because people just like you who are watching this video, you see those people. I see those people, right? And I was jealous of them. I wanted those likes and comments and I was chasing them. And I ended up making content that was for the likes and comments, not, not for value to my audience and to my ideal audience. And you just live with false expectations. It's like social media shaming, right? It's crazy shit that people do to cultivate false engagement that falsely increases their ticket price so they can sell their services. Um, and do you know what? If you can do it and you are doing it and you're making a living out of it, fair play, but you're selling a hollow service to people. You're selling empty promises and I hate it. I'm going to say it out loud. I hate it. So if you're one of those people, unfollow me, block me, disconnect right now because I'm going to unravel all your secrets over the next few days and you're not going to like it. Sorry. And if you're like me, just an average Joe, sat at the computer, staring at these people's posts where four minutes earlier they, they posted something that you could have written yesterday with no training whatsoever, and now all of a sudden they've got 253 comments um, from people who have the same job title as them, there's a hint, from the same job title as them, just stop following them. They're not real. They're not helpful. They're not adding value, and they're tiring. It's just a waste of energy. Watch out for this rant. Come back tomorrow for more of this.